welcome back to Monday AWF from Los Angeles, California. This is the main event, and we have seen events unfold left and right on the hands of a lot of people, a lot of parties. Talk about that heinous attack on Tamika Brown by the quote-unquote two-woman power trip. It really has been the wild, wild west tonight from Revenant and Varenarius reenacting Godzilla and King Kong right there on the stage from Bumblebee and Jan Hawaii. There's been a lot here, but we've made it to the main event in one piece. CM Loke, the people's champ, and Vincenzo, two foes that seem to be destined to do this dance until time stops moving. But now Vincenzo is the one with the AWF World Championship. It, it was the Intercontinental Championship, and it was CM Loke with the briefcase that, I mean, sort of sparked this rivalry, and now we're going to have another chapter of it here on Monday AWF. We had another chapter on SmackDown. It was CM Loke teaming with Kilgore and Mamba Ant to take on Titville. Yeah, exactly. See a lot of them going at it physically, but, you know, just... Well, you can imagine spirit. they were thinking about it. Here they go. Oh, whoa, oh. And Vincenzo... The bastard, Anthony Kingsley, gift wrapping Vincenzo and Tipville USA a mid card title shot of their of the the, the the Chaos Championship, the Renegade Championship, IC Championship, all on the table. Tipville is doing big business right now. I got to tell you right now, Tipville, at least Anthony Kingsley is investing in at least one group of talent that's going to make him money. Tipville USA is better than I've ever seen them here. And Vincenzo, look at that, basking in the ambience of his people because he's the champion of these people, whether they like it or not. Well, so he's going to face down the people's champion here, right here and right now. And I don't give a damn what you say. Nobody is behind the people more than CM Lowe. Well, we got a hell of a lot of respect for CM Lowe. You know that. I know that. But Vincenzo is the champion of the Catch world. Catch it right here. Penis DDT. Looking to take out Vincenzo early. Perhaps they're going to make it as quick as Vincenzo's Intercontinental Championship reign. Spirit, Spirit of, of Vengeance. CM Lowe. Hooks the leg. One, two. In all due respect for CM Lowe. He hasn't had the best of luck as of lately. Winning, losing via countout to both the Nasty Noodle and Roman Reigns. Other folks have just caught him, just caught him slipping, as they say. And they're right down the, on the leg. You're right. The People's Champ certainly hasn't had the best streak of luck. But you need to forget all about that right now. He is in the ring with one of the most dangerous men in the AWF and the ruler of the AWF, Vincenzo. He's got the world championship to prove it. He is at the top of the mountain somewhere that I think CM Loke and a lot of these people right here in Los Angeles thought Vincenzo would never be. But he is proving them wrong day by day by being the dawn of the AWF and CM Loke now. And then runs him right in to the barricade, right into the entertainment part of the actions. Cranks up the arm, down on, a, on it still, CM Loaf. The technical mastermind, the switchblade wrestler. I don't know how CM Loke hasn't been conflicted as of late with all the moving pieces here in the AWF. I mean, we saw him team with Mamba Ann and Kenneth Kilgore. That's all well and good, but lest we not forget what Mamba oh, Ann God. did to him oh! at the Renegade War Zone. I mean, CM Loke, I hope, hasn't forgotten. He needs to keep all his boundaries up around that guy. He's a snake. You can never, ever trust the snake. Spot down, Hurricane Runner, one, two, three, several of them raining it down. You know, it's funny. I think CM Loaf and Vincenzo, they really are two phenomenal professional wrestlers that in another universe, they might have a healthy amount of respect for one another. And maybe they do, but it's certainly not showing it here. Nice mission, local driver by CM Loaf. Is this going to be it here? Let's see. Whoa! Not for, the, not for the type of to get, hey, get in, get, get in this. Mamba Ant has guaranteed he will use his title clause rematch against Vincenzo. That's right, that's right. For, oh! oh! Nice 630 splash by CM Lowe. 
the athleticism of the people's champ on display. He's going to follow it up here with the hellacious, ravenous spirit of vengeance. Tammy Vincenzo would have. The referee. One, two, no. And even that sequence, that electric sequence, you heard every single person here in Los Angeles rise to their feet. That really was something, that move through the air by CM Loaf, but still not enough to keep the dawn away. Off the look at this. Hey! A nice backflip, CM Loaf is, he is like a rabid animal here. But Vincenzo. Right there, stops him. At the damn brick wall. He's built like one too, folks. Look at this. What, what the hell, Vincenzo? Oh my goodness, over the top rope. The AWF world champion. And for CM Loaf, he wants to get the world that world championship back one day. And Vincenzo showing him exactly what he's got to go up against if he wants to get it back. Nothing to crash land his fall. CM Loaf hitting the concrete just back first and spine first. And you mentioned, yes, CM Loaf has expressed his desires to be oh, a world no, champion oh, no, oh, once no. again. Oh! And Power Vincenzo. Bomb. CM Loaf showing his strength. But he's got to get through the. He's got to get through Tibble. He's got to get through the Don. And perhaps you mentioned it earlier. He might have to get through his bread killer's comrade, Mamba Ant. And we know how that guy gets about titles. He won't let anyone get in his way, friend or foe. And the right suplex. You know, but, but let's not talk about Vincenzo's reign posthumously. It's still going. It's still going strong. Just like him and his man. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, Silver Viper, the, the newest member of Monday AWF, via the trade. Way to pick your spots, old man. This is not the time. This is Vincenzo's time. I know you just might have woken up is from it, your elderly is nap. It Small up package with the one, up, with the roll two, up. Not like this, damn it. Not like what the hell. They get a heist as well. See him loaf. With the alley from Silver Viper. This is highway robbery. Finally snaps his losing streak. Is that what you're calling that right there? He got a win, didn't he? It seems like Tidville has got multiple targets on their back from multiple angles. Silver Viper making his presence known in the main event where he shouldn't have been sticking his nose into someone else's business and CM Loaf right now is laughing at Vincenzo. He didn't outsmart the damn guy. Yes, he did. That's exactly what he did. That is not what happened. This was a match, mano y mano, to settle a difference, and Silver Viper had to stick his nose where it didn't belong. Wah, wah, wah. Thank you for watching Monday AWF from Agent A and Agent K. We will see you on SmackDown. Have a good one.